Morning everyone. Um, today I want to talk to you about putting in your time to master your craft or to move your business forward uh, or just to move your life forward in general. And I just want to say that no one has ever become grossly successful by only putting in 40 hours a week, right? And what I mean by grossly successful is not necessarily that they become a millionaire or a billionaire. Um, it's not all monetary gains. I'm talking grossly successful in anything. Um, think about your family life, right? What if in your family, with your partner and or your children, you only put in 40 hours of effort a, a, a week, right? So maybe you did nine to five where you're caring about your family and your kids. And then the rest of your day, you just go away and you don't do anything. You don't think about them. You don't talk to them. You don't put in any effort, right? How would that go? It, it wouldn't go well. Um, same with your profession, right? Even if what you want is a normal nine to five job, if you put in 40 hours a week, just nine to five, eight hours a day, nothing on the weekends, nothing at night, you don't spend any time reading articles about your profession, you don't spend any time talking to people about your profession, you don't sp spend any time trying to gain skills outside of your job for your profession, you're probably not gonna reach it to the top of that profession. Um, think about crafts. What if you do like pottery or woodworking um, as, a, as a hobby, right? You can put in a few hours a day here and there, but in order to become like a master craftsman at this thing, it's probably gonna take you a few decades, right? It's about putting in the time, and with a hobby, it's over time with your profession or what you wanna be ultimately successful at. It's about putting in as much time every day as you can. Um, you know, with, with Gallant Bullets, I put in, I don't know how many hours a day, but usually it's quite a few. Um, for instance, yesterday was a Sunday. My fiance and I were down at the shop. I was putting in racking for our new shirts, um, and we were there until 11 o'clock last night. And then I get up first thing in the morning, and here we are, morning coffee, and I'm, I'm doing content for the website, and I'm putting in more time into the website, into the company, and I'm usually thinking about it <laughs> almost always. Um, I just want to say you got to put that time in, you got to put that effort in, and it has to be that driving passion. It ties into that why that we talked about, and it ties into just putting it all in, your whole life, into what you want to do. Um, there's a saying that goes, you have to put in 10,000 hours to master your craft. I'm not sure if 10,000 hours is accurate, but I am sure that practice and dedication and perseverance in a craft definitely are a key contributor to making it in that craft. Um, don't downplay it. Don't cut yourself short on your time because you want to go watch a show. You want to binge watch some Netflix. Um, always find the balance that we were talking about, but you got to find your own balance and you got to make sure you're pushing yourself up to that balance every single day of every single week. All right, guys. Hey, if you're only viewing this video on Facebook or Instagram, you're getting literally like less than 20% of what the episode actually is. Um, we upload the full episodes to our website. It's usually a minute and a half, two minutes. Um, it's a lot longer than the 19 seconds you're getting. You can also see some supporting um, documentation down there. I put links to articles, videos, um, and we also have the comment section where you can add comments on the website. We can have a full discussion on the topic. So make sure to go to the website, see the whole video, and see all the supplementing documentation, and we'll see you there. Thank you.